Going green is a phrase many are not too familiar with, but the concept is about practices that can lead to more environmentally friendly and ecologically responsible decisions and lifestyles, which can help protect the environment and sustain its natural resources. It is against this backdrop that Eco Hotel and Suites launched an eco-friendly initiative that includes planting of trees. <laughs> The organizers of the event say they are aware of the effects of climate change and are prepared to make things right. First of all, we have to be part of the solution, not part of the problem. Every one of us can be a steward of our environment. During just the month of March, we are proud to announce that we have saved 7,764 kilograms of CO2 by recycling plastic. Other guests talked about ways to make matters of the environment gain traction. Try to incentivize waste. So when you give us your waste, you get something back in turn. And again, using art, for instance, I want to have a show. Why do I need to pay for the ticket? Instead of paying for the ticket, why not tell people come with 20 plastic bottles and get a free ticket? And so this is a very important occasion to use both of the medium itself you know, and the subject itself. So when the two come together, then the impact will be more meaningful. If we inculcate this in our own little way in the curriculum, it's really going to create that much awareness at the grassroots level. The event also featured an eco-friendly art contest which produced 10 finalists with the overall winner cutting away a 200,000 Naira prize gift. One of the top five participants talked about her work and experience at the contest. I met a lot of friendly people. The contestants were all, all nice people, very nice, very nice crowd. The winners, they won my very good. It was, it's a very, it was a very, it was a fun experience. It has become clear that to get a large chunk of people to buy into environmental matters like they do singing and acting, creative means of sending the message across board must be employed. Only then can the effects of climate change be dealt with collectively. Vivian Uche for STV News.